it's funny. All the uh, Unfinity haters out there, go to hell. <laughs> go to hell. All right, one card on the bottom for both, a multi-six for both. Basic Swamp for Derek. I'm going to play Chromox. Chromox and printing Ravenloft Adventurer. Oh, there you go. For some reason, I thought it was the, the Ixalan Bat card for a second. That's what the oh, art looked yeah. like to me. If only that was playable in this format. Seat of the Synod Clown Car. Sorry, says. It is even. Right, here. Draw. So Clown Car will enter with a plus one plus one counter on it. No clown robots this time. Here's our Urza Saga. That. Patchwork Automaton? Sounds good. There's Patchwork Automaton. Mox Opal triggers the Automaton. Three. 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 Yeah, whatever. You got it. That's fine. Um, Targeting. All right, here's Thoughtcast. Yeah, quite a few cards so far in this game that I don't think legacy players have memorized, so uh, we're going to keep an eye on all of them. Hers is Bobble now. We're going to see a card from Derek's hand. Let's see what we find. Troll of Casa Doom. Um, uh, pass turn? Uh, oh, actually, wait, sorry. I'm dumb. Uh, sorry. Uh, crew? Correct, correct your play, yeah. Crew, swing for two. Mm -hmm. You was compared to Ariel, I would still allow it. All right. And then pass. All right. Attacking for two with the clown car. Forgot about the crewing just for a moment there. It's all good. Oh, yeah, I can crew that. <laughs> love it, love it. All right. Derek will drop a Ravenloft Adventurer. It will resolve. Board game time. Which, um, no, I have a whole thing. Which, um, which meeple do you want? I'll let you pick. Ooh. Um, which I'm I'll go want? orange. Orange, awesome. I want to go That's green. Red. red. What is this? All right, so Derek arrives at the secret entrance. It's board game time. Basic Swamp has been found. We legacy players love sagas, but a saga that lasts for the rest of the game that both players have to fight over, we don't like. Just uh, in case anybody at Wizards is watching. <laughs> Very specific about this stuff. Right, everybody? We want sagas to be temporary, not last for the rest of the game. God. Yeah, we're hard to please. Some might say it's impossible. All right, so a 3-3 Patchwork Automaton, 2-2 two -two Clown Car, ready to be crewed. Urza Saga has ticked up to two, so we might see some Constructs get pumped out. It's all happening. Ravenloft Adventure is a 3-4. So taking the initiative might be a challenge. Um, yeah. Case of the Filched Falcon? Case of the Filched Falcon. Let's see if legacy players know this one. So this is the the only case we've seen on 90s MTG so far is Case of the Fil Filch Falcon. I've seen it played in a couple of different decks. It immediately gets solved. Just like the legacy format is solved, of course. I'm gonna put two plus one plus one counters on to uh, this. All right, moving into the Forge, two plus almost on counters on Ravenloft Adventure. It's now a 5-6. Five, six. Five, Derek looking at his options. Case of the Filch Falcon is solved. And uh, could turn something into a bird with four plus almost on counters. Passageway Seer getting forced pitching. Ooh, what was that blue card that got pitched? Is that was that a cryptic coat? Oh, uh, let's see. So one, so, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Pass. 
and instead you, make a construct? Yep. Sure. Yep. You in search. Um, I'll make another construct. Yeah, I can All right, no opposition agent on Derek's side. We know Derek runs that card. Safely searching. Searching your deck is scary against Derek these days, folks. Shadow Spear is found. That's a good one. Totex Spear. Totex Spear. Sorry. I know. What year is it? Uh, good fight here. Uh, Lantern turn? Trigger? Yeah. Uh, uh, one of my bowmasters? Yeah. I will stay for through this thing. Constructs are pretty big. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Huge. I'm gonna cycle that floor and reveal. Yep. <laughs> Shadow spear. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yep. eight, nine. That's nine, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. So this one would be a nine nine. Nine nine life linker with trample. I think we're going to see D uh, David take the initiative here. Cards, one. Oh, right. Right, right, right. I'm going to go nine. You go to uh, 28. You get the initiative. It's not going to help me here. <laughs> All right, Derek will take the initiative. Searching the library now for a basic island. There it is. How the heck is Derek going to win this? On top? Yep. Draw? Yeah. Sure, lean into it. <laughs> um, sure, I'll lean into it. Trigger. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Can you... And then that was all. Mirror Universe? Yeah, maybe. Still at the Void Walker. All right, that's a way to take the initiative, I guess. And a second Void Walker. Creature on Derek's side that is not a Void Walker is Ravenloft Adventure. That's how we took the initiative in this game for the first time. <laughs> oh, man. If this Bullmaster, Bullmaster, Bull doesn't kill this one. It's an outlaw. Put that in the notes. Oh, gosh. And then more in your Lord. Legacy players these days are researching like crazy which creatures are outlaws and which creatures aren't and how are we going to solve the Thunder Junction meta. It's on all of our minds. Okay. Three. Uh, I'm going to sacrifice this. Um, all right. Curse of case of the Filch Falcon sacrifice. Clown car getting some counters. I love it. It's a bird clown car. <laughs> Alright, that's five. Um, six, six flyer. Mopo, trigger, legend roll. No, it'll be XL with a uh, void walker. Sorry, also, the case is XL too. Yep. Um, that's fine. Yeah. Normal XL, Dothy XL. Seed um, combat. Swing. Swing. The game two. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, a gigantic attack, and we're going to game two. Derek will not be able to beat that. Looks like we're ready to go. Yeah, everything is kicker. I wish they would stop making mechanics like the mechanic we love. Erborg, thoughts use. Let's see what we got. Yep. Seed of the Synod, Urza's Saga, Urza's Bobble Times 2, Case of the Filch Falcon. Mox Opal and Dismember. <laughs> no, you, those are fine. I'm taking uh, this. I'm not taking this. Here's your choice. I'm going to take Dismember. Okay, Dismember is taken. So the removal spell is chosen. That makes some sense if you know what Derek's up to these days. Let's see. Are we going to see a turn one case of the Filch Falcon? Wait, what's going on here? <laughs> uh, Another one. This is where you play ahead, everybody. So. Uh, I go see, tap, 
uh, case. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. so, Make yeah, a clue token. Pity oh, no. fair. I guess Derek's preparing for Urza's baubles. Play the two baubles. Play Mox Opal. Derek, David just throwing cards on the table. Doesn't give a damn. Case of the Filch Falcon is solved. We have to get David some of the uh, DCI sanctioned solved counters that came in Karlov Manor booster packs. Our dark Ritual is found. Uh, shuffle again. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, okay. Dark Rit Shieldred. Alright, um, sounds good. Um, I and I were Alright, Shieldred revealed as the second card. Whenever I play all the time. But when it's like an actual, like, round. Uh, I'm gonna name Phyrexian. Like, like, Naming Phyrexian with Cavern of Souls. That's scary. Like, damn it! He's right. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm gonna start the music on the light. So you do that. It has to be a non creature artifact? Yes, it has to be a non creature artifact. That's a point. How do I beat the track? Yeah, I'm sure. When I don't play it, when you just like straight does it, and they have a little bit of a problem. Black Shell. That's All right, there's Shouldered the Apocalypse, and uh, that makes things complicated. I'm not going to be thought casting much with that on the table. There's a saga. Case of the Filch Falcon. I feel like I keep saying curse. Can have uh, this clue turn into a 4 4 bird. Or the Mox Opal, I guess. <laughs> but Shouldred's going to be hard to race. Shouldered is a Phyrexian after all. That's why Cavern was on Phyrexian. Patchwork Automaton. Shadow Spear. Trigger. All right. We're building here. And then one card, right? Two. Two, 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 two. two cards left in David's hand. Derek's going to gain two life from Shouldered. Plays Ancient Tomb. That's at one right now, right? Uh, the Saga? Yeah. yeah, Saga's at one. Uh, black man now. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh boy. Viral and Plague. Derek got me with this card. It's it's anti dinosaur tech. Creature tokens get minus two, minus two. Oh, it's based on each artifact? No. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm saying for the inevitable constructs. Um, <laughs> yeah, so it'll be, it would solve this at three, that's fine. Uh, combat? Uh, you'll, you'll for four. four Alright, Shouldered will attack. And passing the turn. Viral and Plague, folks. That's how you know Naya, Doctor Who, Stompy is uh, a real threat. The metagame has shifted and people are running viral and plague in the sideboard. Yeah. Now we got two more. Metagame reacting. So Urza Saga can start pumping out Constructs now. Shadow Spear is pretty damn good. Case of the Filch Falcon is solved and can turn either this Clue or this Mishra's Bobble into a 4-4 flyer at some point. Or Shadow Spear, I guess. Um, upkeep, I'm going to do something. Upkeep. Uh, uh, black uh, Op Agent. Opposition agent on upkeep, so maybe gonna try and steal whatever the Zerzo Saga can find. Yeah. 
Is it virulent plague? I don't know. I just realized I don't know. I don't think I ever even said it out loud before. Can slam it? Two cards there? Two. No? You don't have something else? Oh. Slam it! There we go. That's a good one. Wow. Never thought that coming. Uh, <laughs> I mean, never thought that I'm just thinking. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. so uh, actually, I'm going to go to my draw step. I draw. Sure. Uh, this ticks up. Yep. Um, Virulent plague? Yeah, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah, who cares? You're going to see. You're going to do the search. I can see your hand. Yep. yep. No search. All right, so Derek will do the search. What will we find? We get a little peek at the deck here. There's a couple of clown cars floating around. Lotus Petal and Odawara in hand. Yeah, I can't search. Oh, that, that white. Oh, yeah, that's more for work. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's great. Yeah, 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 yeah. Your options are bobbles, petals, multiple. Yeah, maybe the Shieldred trigger was missed this turn. I wasn't really watching that carefully. All right, so Mishra's bauble gets placed under the opposition yeah, agent. So the other stuff. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I was like, yeah, you can have it. <laughs> yep. Also, you trigger for the, uh, almost for the uh, Shelly, so you're 10. Combat? Yep. yep. Cool. All right, so the Shieldred trigger was remembered after all. All right, so Urza Saga made a construct, and then Derek stole something. Not too important. Seven. There's seven. The constructs are sevens. You have two cards in hand? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll play it. Play this in the one that can attack? Yep. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's an eight, eight. Trample lifeline. This is on my draw stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, my, my upkeep. I mean, I'll go to my main phase. I drew this card for the turn. Yeah. 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 That's fine. <laughs> Somehow I feel like this was miscounted. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. N I'm counting nine artifacts. And then Shadow Spear. Whatever. Oh, they're minus two from the, the plague. All right, so they're eight eights. That was that was right. That's true. I'll cast uh, Mistress. I'll cast your Mistress Bubble. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna target you with it. Yeah, it's random. That's cool. It's random. Um, I'll pass. I'll keep. I'll go to six, uh, sixteen. I mean, I'm gonna go eighteen over right here. Oh yeah, I'm draw yeah, from yeah, the uh, yeah, yeah. bubble. So you draw, and I'll cycle um, the land you know about. So it should be 16. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the burn man, the burn man. <laughs> yeah, we forgot about the plague for a second there. Is it virulent plague, virulent plague, virulent plague? Nobody knows. Into bird? It'll be a 2 2. It'll be a 2 2. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right, Filch Falcon sacrificed. Makes that clue a bird, but it gets minus two, minus two. So this is a seven, seven, seven and game. this is yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Eight, eight. Oh, yeah. That's trample. Yes, trample. So. All right, big attack. Uh, yeah, this thing just feels too much like I have to put it. Kiviyuk is here. Hello, Chris and Chet. Yeah, the world may never know. And like, once, if you've got Leyland and sign in play, like, yeah. the only answer is an edict. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. have to block. Like, if you had, uh, had you had, sure block because of my mid sequence, I opened you up to a situation so where you just like, uh, one, two, three, four, yeah. five, yeah. five, six, seven, yeah. eight, eight, nine, I ten, to so eight, eight, eight. Yeah, I have to block. I was cheeky and like, oh, I could just block it with my death. Looks like chumping with opposition agents. Keeping Shieldred around? Six, seven, eight, nine. So, yeah, so seven, seven, eight. Seven, seven, eight. Red. Yeah. Red. 
White gives a vigil. And then this is just swing for two here. <laughs> virulent. Virulent plague. All right. We figured it out. I didn't even think about first So we do it, but then you re equip. Thinking about these blocks, thinking about Shildred. Hmm. The construct equipped with Shadow Spear has trample. And it's an 8-8. Eight, eight. The other one is a 7-7. Seven, seven. Can I go to 8? Yeah. I'll go to 8. Yeah. Like. So I go to yeah. 24. Yeah, absolutely right. Four. But then What's base will trade. I still want to go. Yeah. Like, you go over the top of a lot of stuff. Okay. Um, I don't know what they're doing. In the end, it's probably the top of the screen. It's not very good. Do I want the card or do I want the one power? Yeah, I'll look at your top card. I can't argue with that. It's true. Okay. Because, like, DRC um, is so yep. much okay. better than... Pew Pew says, I always considered initiative a good matchup for 8-cast, but this full blue stompy version crushes initiative even harder, in my opinion. Yeah, this, this deck seems really tough to beat for initiative. Or any stompy deck, really. Taking the initiative, not advisable against a deck like 8-cast. Yeah. Raven lost yeah, so sure. Round one of my biggest rollers. Not advised, not advisable. I don't know. We've had so many mispronounced words on today's stream, we're just going to leave it there. Ravenloft Adventurer. Is it Ravenloft or Ravenloft? Eight. Ravenloft? Reanimate Tarn Shelly. I'll go to four. Reanimating Shieldred, going to four. Derek has taken the initiative now. I'm not trying to. So I'll pass. Go 22. And then you draw. School card. Considering that when you was balanced, you work as one of You have to work for it like some cast or something. Once you can just bounce. It's not just it's like yeah, that's fine. Uh, trip. I should get a second crew token. Yeah, just make it that big. That big. Should, I already bring like extra token. You gotta get the Yu Yu card that Hale has. Clue token? Yep. Oh boy, that's a clue token? <laughs> that's not very good. Out of all the people, you're the first one to say no. <laughs> no Yu Gi Oh card. That's a 3 2, that's a 4 or 5. So 1, 2, 3. No more Dungeons and Dragons sets, Audrey. We, we've had enough. Us legacy players have had enough. Give us more Tomb Raider. <laughs> Tomb Raider should have been a whole block. Suit to combat? Mm -hmm. I'll swing this. So this is a 2 2 in the air. And then this is a 8 8 reduced down to 6. So it's 6 6. 8 8 6. I have to double block. Another big attack. The clue is a bird with four plus one plus one counters on it. But it's a token, so it gets minus two, minus two from the the plague. I give up on pronouncing the plague. It's, it, I give up. It's over. I'm going to go to six. Card selection. Rick is at three. Thinking about how to block these. Uh, All right, block double blocking. That's a, wait, that's six, right? Yeah. yeah. So how much toughness is that? This is six. Okay, six toughness. Okay. This is all, so that everything would die, and then I take okay. I take so two. I go to two. One, two but you get three, the initiative. Five, six. I go to twenty-eight. This dies. I get the initiative. You know, we'll just park it uh, I do not have a basic land, so I'm just forced to shuffle. Yep. All right, the construct dies. Shieldred lives. The clue that is now a 4 4. Well, it's a 2 2 with 4 plus one counters on it. Case of the Filch Falcon will be solved, so we might be able to make another bird. And uh, it's all happening. And tap, I'll draw for a turn, I'll go 4. <laughs> I'm gonna have 
four in the air, five in the air. I pass. Um, okay, I will spend three mana. This is now also a bird. Yep, it'll be a two two bird. I have two 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 birds. Okay, so two 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 birds on David's side. Curse case of the Filch Falcon. I keep saying curse is sacrificed. Well, I mean you're you're at four. Mm -hmm. Fine. Uh, two 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 birds. I know it's represented by three cards right now, but attacking for four. No scoop face. <laughs> All right, that is the game. Ancient Tomb was the only card left in hand for Derek. Derek in shambles. GG's. Yeah, maybe we forgot about Shadow Spear there. I don't know.